Alright guys, what's up? So in this video, I'm going to go over how you can launch and test an idea fast AF with the help of Claude. And I think you can actually test really quick ideas in one to four hours. So in, in this video, I'm going to do a live demo. As some background, I have a lot of experience with coding. All of my previous projects have been with code. Exploding Insights, for example, I made it in Django, but I think with the release of Claude and the newest models, you can create prototypes way faster than if you did with no code. So that's one of the major benefits of Claude right now. And the benefit of that is that you don't need to spend time or money finding a developer. You can pretty much just prototype everything yourself. Plus, there's less risk of you wasting your time because you don't have to learn no code. So let me just go over um, one quick example and then I'm going to do a analysis of like how I would mass prototype these ideas. So in Exploding Insights, you can find ideas that you can prototype. So one of the biggest bottlenecks right now is you want to start a SaaS or you want to start a side project, but you're not sure what idea is already validated and you don't want to waste your time building stuff that people won't buy. So Exploring Insights helps with this. It's a database of ideas. So this is for the category of flyer design. Obviously, there's a bunch of other categories that you can also search for. But for this video, I'm just going to do flyer design. You can go through the database and just find an a idea that you like. And then say you want to turn it into SaaS. That's possible right now with Claude. So let's say I scroll through and I really like this idea of designing a professional business flyer or poster. This idea has already made $120,000 and this is the service on Fiverr. They charge $40 for creating this flyer and the premium is $9. They have over 2000 reviews. So this is already a validated idea. Let's say I want to create a SaaS from this and I want to validate it fast. So what is the next step open Claude and I've already tested this out for you guys, but essentially what you do is you paste in the idea and problem. So this is the problem that I searched for. Let me just show you guys in the database. So this one here, design professional flyers and posters within five hours. This gig has already made $40,000. And the pain point is that the person wants a flyer. What you do is you paste in this and you just tell Claude to make me a SaaS frontend that can solve this problem. It will generate this UI here that you can see. And the benefit is that it will give you the code. So here is the code that you can just copy and paste and use. So this is for a React app. Obviously, if you're not familiar with React, you can change it. I personally use Vue.js, so I would just clarify for Claude to just change it into that language, but it's really easy and it can do it with one prompt. So you don't need to worry about that. The next prompt I mentioned is make it functional. And then after I mentioned that it created this UI here, let me go over the problem again. Basically we want to create flyers. So the UI is there's a design tab, a templates tab and a save design tab. And on the first uh, page, you can see that you can select the, the tab, which is flyer or poster. You can have a title. So let's say looking for developer. Let me see if this actually works. So yeah, you can see that it actually fully functional. You can upload image. It, it has a text. So the text is being updated. You can even change the background color, text color. This is all functional with this react app. You can change the font size. It's even responsive, which I didn't know that it would do, but yeah, it's making sure that it's in the scope and then you can even download it or save. And this is all with only one prompt. The code is all here. And yeah, basically the point is that it's very easy to build and test ideas. So the first step is to build prototype with Claude. And if you need ideas, you just go to Exploring insights to find an idea to test. There's so many ideas that if you want to build like 10 prototypes within one hour, uh, I'm sure it's positive. I'll probably make a video building 10 SaaS within one hour. But what you do is you build a prototype with Claude. If you need ideas, you go to Exploring Insights to find ideas that are validated. And then the third step is obviously this is a free version, so anyone can use it. But what you can do is you can add a button on the page for them to pay with Stripe. And after they pay with Stripe, 
you would give them the pro version. Easy way to do this is that you would host a pro version on a subdomain. So what this means is that your main free app will be on, let's say, flyers.com. So the main site is hosted on flyers.com. And then after they pay, you would show them or you would give them access to a subdomain. So let's say it's paid.flyers.com. So th this is only access once the person has paid. This means that you don't need to worry about user authentication. You don't need to worry about payments because it's just a simple Stripe payments. Even within Claude, you can probably ask it to add a paywall where the person has to pay to download the image. You can even tell Claude to update the code based on adding the paywall. Let me just go over the four steps again. So the first step is to find an idea on Explain Insights. The second step is to build the prototype using Claude. The third step is to add a payments method. So you can just add a paywall that redirects to a subdomain after the person has paid. And this is how you would build and test ideas within one hour. None of this requires any coding knowledge. I guess as a quick mention, what you can do is you can host the app on Vercel. I personally like Vercel because they are free. So you can host the React app on Vercel. And even if it's like a HTML page or a view app, Vercel will also host that site. That's a really free, easy way to host your apps. There's an error here. Sometimes in Claude, you might get errors. So you need to prompt it to fix it. What you can do is you can just copy the error fix this error. I'm not going to make this video go on too long, but essentially a lot of the coding, you don't need any coding knowledge. I, for example, don't have any knowledge with React and I was able to actually make a MVP pretty fast with just Claude and it's all within three prompts. So I think there is an error because this requires a NPM install. Let me see if I can fix it. Otherwise, I'm not going to spend this video debugging this code, but the previous version of it was working. So let me just see if this will fix it. Yeah, obviously the design is not the greatest, but it is working, right? And you have the button to pay and allow you to download the image. So you can play around with the aesthetics, just prompt it with make the app more aesthetic and beautiful something like that and it will fix it but you can see that you're able to get a working prototype really fast and i remember even back in college i would learn react and it would take me days just to get the same app that you can make in one hour right now i think it's a really good opportunity especially if you don't know how to code to test a lot of apps right now because it's super easy with Claude and this video is just proof of that. So yeah, I'll probably make more coding videos in the future showing guys how you can prototype ideas really fast. I'll leave it at that and see you guys in the next video.